As the floodwaters recede in Haiti, the scale of the disaster brought by Tropical Storm Hannah is only just emerging. According to the United Nations Office for the Coordination of Humanitarian Affairs, the death toll in Haiti has exceeded 500 and is growing by the hour. The UN is also launching an emergency appeal saying that 600,000 people need urgent help. The port city of Gonaive has been worst hit. Mark Worthington sends this report. For the people of Gonaive, fresh water is worth fighting for. <laughs> Days after Tropical Storm Hannah hit Haiti's fourth largest city, the floodwaters have only just begun to recede. Tens of thousands were stranded. Now they desperately need food and shelter. Aid vehicles are starting to get through, and what they're finding is devastation. As the water level drops, there are grim discoveries. More bodies have been found. The number of dead continues to rise. The authorities are calling it a catastrophe. The city's mayor has asked for national and international solidarity to prevent another disaster. The first large delivery of aid has arrived. A UN ship carrying 33 tonnes of bottled water high energy biscuits and rice. But more is needed. Crops have also been destroyed. Haiti has been hit by three storms in three weeks, and another is on the horizon. The main force of Hurricane Ike may miss the country, but with many streets still underwater, any more rain could bring further floods. Mark Worthington, BBC News.